Hey guys, Braden here with ATT. I don't have a lot of time, so if you want this full version of the Awesome Pottery Trap, you can just head to patreon.com slash Podcast. We need this support. The support helps the show tremendously. You've got two ways to support Patreon or Supercast, or you can just top up the beer coffers by scanning that code and sending us some beer money. Anyways, I hope you enjoy our Awesome Pottery Cap and think about supporting the show. Thanks, guys. Enjoy. Flying V, let's flying go. Flying V, and then we just parted, we parted the street as a flying V. Yeah, that's fucking great. Uh, then we, dude, first off, the next person to get fucking meat draw wasted. Oh my god! Oh fuck! Well, no, lizard. not meat draw. This guy got fucking full yeah. reptilian lizard. Liz face. Uh, lizard caveman was fucking. Woo! He was on. Uh, he was on. He was on a level. He was on his a level. Tongue, his tongue was permanently out of his mouth for the entire he evening. Had, he had T Rex hands. You know someone's ah, drunk when they got ah. T Rex arms. Well, I, th- I think he may have been. Uh, he was, you know, r- I think him and uh, Riemann were just. Oh, well, had a shooting, lot of uh, edibles too. Shooting edibles and uh, just popping them. So he's, he was. Uh, we went to. I remember we went to the next bar and uh, he was just like. Ah, ah. Oh yeah, and he's like <laughs> screaming like metal screaming to like Britney Spears. <laughs> yeah. Fucking throwing high kicks and shit, uh, smack and smack and drinks out of out of the out of the uh, <laughs> out of the air. Uh, pretty pretty, yeah, it was pretty fucked up. <laughs> it was pretty fucked up. It was pretty funny. Uh, we ended up at this bar where this guy, there's a mechanical bull, and there's this guy that's so fucking drunk, and he's trying to get on the bull, and the guy operating bull's just not letting him get on. He keeps moving, and the guy's getting tossed off, <laughs> and everyone's laughing at him. And I'm like, hey man, yeah, like, all right. He's like, well, it's ten bucks. I was like, that guy paid ten bucks. He goes, no, that guy's drunk. Just walked up there. That's why I'm not letting him get on. And I'm like, all right. Well, he's like, I was like, I'm not gonna pay ten bucks. He's like, it's free, but I get to fuck you up. And I'm like, all right. I was like, well, how bad are you gonna fuck me up? I was like, are you gonna fuck me up as bad as this guy? He's like, nah. He's like, I like, I like you, so you can get on there. So this guy comes. This, the drunk guy gets told by security to beat it. So he comes off, I'm like gearing up to go. And like, he's, this guy's fucking hammered. And he comes up to me, and he like gives me this look and he's like, like offended that I'm going to go on it. Hmm. And uh, I was like, all right, whatever, man. Like, it's all good. Uh, so I, you he's know, probably I like, this guy doesn't have what it takes to rodeo. Yeah. So then, uh, where is it here? I just, oh, nice, Woo! nice mount. Well, because he, he wasn't letting people get on it, so I knew I had to get on it quick. I couldn't get on it from the side. Rode it for a little bit, and I knew he was going to eventually try to fuck me up, so I I was like, yeah, I just let it go here. Boom. Little did I know, folded myself in fucking half. <laughs> oh, dude, like, I hurt, like, mid-back, like, really bad. It wasn't as cushiony as I thought it was going to be when I landed. Winded myself, so I, like, instantly went from there straight up to the bathroom to have oh. and i thought i was gonna fucking puke and i was like i was stretching out on the sink i was like oh man i was all fucked up like <laughs> my ribs were all sore i was like fuck i was like that sucked i tried to do the uh, same trick like, i'll go on that if you can fuck me up he's like no 10 bucks i was like what <laughs> <laughs> uh yeah it's, it's pretty fun man and, like good times the bars were fine we we hit a couple up um we were fucking dancing on poles at the last one like it was it was they say wild we, times. you mean you. Yeah. Yeah, whatever. It was fun. There's other, pe- was was fun other little... people there. It was a fun bar crawl. Started early. Yeah. Ended at our normal. Uh, we ended at 12. That doesn't mean the oh, night. Yeah. Anya, Anya fucking <laughs> bicycle parked her car on 6th Street. Oh, Got right. a huge ticket. Had to move her car halfway through the night. Halfway through the bar crawl. <laughs> in the in a packed, <laughs> packed street. Oh, that was funny. Too ter- good. Turns out they wrote her license plate down wrong. It was the wrong state yeah. or something. Yeah, but we were scared. Dude, I had like the female staff looking in the bathrooms for her and stuff. I'm like, did, did she did she get kidnapped? Like, what happened? We, yeah, we were calling her. Like, we were trying yeah. to keep everyone together. It's kind of hard when there's that many people. Oh, especially when one girl goes missing. You're like, oh, Ooh, shit. Yeah, make sure she's okay. She was all right. She's fine. She took off. She, absolute beauty. Um, Dude, it was, uh, it was a time. That was night, time. again. Around midnight, smoke grenade, smoke grenade. If we're fucking done, man. Drink. We're done. Too many drinks. Too fucked it's been up. Been a long day. Best part, we go in the middle of the street. Big fucking quack, 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 qu
big old Rufio, Rufio, Rufio. <laughs> good times. Uh, good times on the pub crawl. Uber back to the place. Right what did we do? Get on Jack Uber box, Eats. Baby. Uber Eats. <laughs> right. Third time's a charm. Did we get Jack in the Box? Fuck no, we did not get Jack in the Box. <laughs> it's unbelievable. It's like a, it, like they were purposely punking us. They wouldn't give us Jack in the Box. It would say order picked up or order delayed or order canceled, order being reordered. It never came. We just never got we, three nights in a row fucking Jack in the Box. Denied. Well, hey, uh, probably for the best. We're like... We didn't need it, but you want it. The, oh, the want worst it. part is, is we're so tired, we're so gassed out, and we end up staying up, struggling, like sitting on the couch, waiting hours for this. Like, so, like every night, we didn't go to bed till like two thirty or three because we're waiting for fucking Jack in the Box. Honestly, waiting for an hour and a half or two hours for Jack in the Box, trying to watch like, like never. Comes. We watch like Naked and Afraid. We're watching Friends, like anything <laughs> yeah, to stay awake. <laughs> Anyways, we. I mean, this story might. This might be a three-hour recap, so we're gonna keep keep it rolling. So uh, Saturday, we Saturday is the day. <laughs> Saturday is the day we plan like the big three right meet and greet where we're going to sit down and just chill. Get to know some people. Get some know some people. We don't have to just like go in like loud bars and try and scream at each other. But we start we start another slow day. But we decide to go to in Austin. There's the Museum of the Weird. Yes. Just like all like the mementos with, of a lot of stuff we talk about and with the. The Minnesota Iceman. Minnesota Iceman. No, like, and and we don't say that. Like, they no, legit v. bought it. Like, if you remember the story of the Minnesota Iceman, the Iceman went missing, reportedly stolen by the CIA. No big deal. Then the Minnesota Iceman pops up on eBay. It is bought by the owner of this establishment, who now shows the Minnesota Iceman. You can just He's walk gonna... in. You pay your saw it. pay your in entrance free. If you're watching the live stream, we have a quick video of it. All right, we're sitting here over top of the Minnesota Iceman. Andrew, what are, your, what are your thoughts seeing in person? Right off the bat, I want to tell you, it is definitely not a gorilla suit stuffed with possum. I would agree. This does not look like a possum of prime. It does not look like a possum of prime. In my, in my books, this looks, you know, like a undiscovered hominid species trapped in ice for 100,000 years. Uh, he died in a traumatic fashion. He's Look at his hand is above his head. Ah! Brain, what do you think? First thoughts. Um, first thought is, God damn, that looks like an ape suit. <laughs> no, no, no. We were discussing it. definitely does not look like an ape suit stuff with possum. No, that's what I meant. Yes. It doesn't. I had a slip up. It's surprising the size of it. I mean, it, it is about eight feet tall. The feet, looking at it, the feet in this one, maybe it's a deception from the ice, but it, the feet seem deceptively smaller than the hands. You guys notice that? It is, yeah. So I don't know if this is some sort of small foot variant of the Bigfoot. So you can yeah, see well. here where they've been chipping away at the ice to get DNA samples there from the palm of the hand and the nose. Yep. Yeah, the ice is a little thin on the face. They almost got to top it up. Yeah, yeah there is some, some hair exposed. Yeah. We need to get a bottle of Dasani here. Okay. Top <laughs> 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 yeah. We should just we'll let him know at the front. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You're gonna have to you're gonna be dealing with some rot here pretty yeah, soon. Absolutely. If you guys don't take care of this thing. Yeah. Uh it's it's amazing to be standing here and looking at this thing after talking about it. I can't and believe knowing, it's so here. and knowing how much money this thing has generated, uh how much controversy this is. It just got another thirty bucks out of us. And it's sitting in a little museum in Austin, Texas. I'll be honest with you though. I mean this does not compare to the world's oldest tractor. I was, no. I was a little disappointed when we asked at the front if you guys have the world's oldest tractor. Quite disappointing, but, uh, you know, we'll settle for the Minnesota. To keep up to date with all things alien theorists theorizing, follow us across social media on Twitter, Instagram, Patreon, and Facebook. For updates on new videos and content on YouTube, don't forget to click like and subscribe and hit that notifications button to keep those eyes on the skies with alien theorists theorizing.